welcome back to the solutions manual in this video we will solve the problem f 4-6 from rc propeller engineering statics 12th edition according to this problem we have to determine the moment of the force about point o so to solve this problem let us resolve this 500 newton force into its components so we have one horizontal component and one vertical component now this angle right here is also 45 degrees let's call this component 500 sin 45 and that component is 500 cos 45 now we have resolved the force into its components so let us find the resultant moment about point O. So we have sum of the moments about point O is equals to I am considering counterclockwise moment as positive. So let us begin with the vertical force component. I can draw its projection right here. This is also 500 sin 45 now this vertical force component is trying to rotate the assembly in counterclockwise direction about point o so it would be taken as positive now for the moment arm by definition moment arm is the perpendicular distance from the line of action of force to the pivot point so this right here is the line of action of the vertical force so for the moment arm we have to find this distance now from the given figure we can clearly see that the distance from point O to this point right here is 3 meters because it is equal to the radius of the circular path now we have to find this much distance, the remaining distance. So let's call this point as A, that one is B, and this is C. So basically we have to find the distance AB. Now for AB, we can consider the ratio, the trigonometric ratio of cos theta. So consider triangle A, B and C. So cos 45 degrees is equal to the adjacent that is AB over the hypotenuse. Now the hypotenuse is equal to the radius of the circular path. So it's also 3 meters. So from here AB becomes 3 cos 45. So our total moment arm becomes 3 plus 3 cos 45 degrees. Now for the horizontal force component, the horizontal force component is trying to rotate the assembly in clockwise direction about point O. So it would be taken as negative. Now for the moment arm. The moment arm for this horizontal force is, if I draw its line of action of force, then the moment arm for this horizontal force component would be this perpendicular distance. And from the given diagram, we can clearly see that, that this perpendicular distance is same as the length BC. So for BC, we have to consider the same ABC triangle and sine 45 degrees is equals to BC over the hypotenuse that is 3 meters. So BC becomes 3 sine 45 degrees.
this perpendicular distance from the given figure is same as the length BC. We have 3 sin 45. So upon solving this equation, we have 1810.66 minus 750. It becomes 1060.66 newtons meter. So this is our answer for this problem. I hope you will find this video helpful. If you do, please make sure to subscribe to this channel and also turn on the bell icon for the daily updates. And if you have any question or any doubt about this problem, then you can ask it in the comment section and I will answer it as soon as possible. Thank you.